Hey guys, how's it going? DUJ2 here, and welcome back to Fortnite Save the World, and welcome to version 8.10. Alright, so in this video, guys, what we're going to do is we're going to jump in, we're going to talk about the new changes in 8.10, as well as some changes that are pretty big and pretty important, but were not talked about in the patch notes um yeah it's kind of crazy uh huge thanks to everyone out there who has been sending me uh messages and, and tweets and and dms and stuff uh there's been a lot of crazy stuff there's a lot of crazy stuff uh, i i did know about a couple of them but wow i cannot believe some of the stuff that was changed and how it's been changed also we're gonna talk about the known issues block which is very interesting very interesting but first well we have a present to open but also i want to give a huge thanks to all of you thank you very much for using my supporter creator code code duj2 right there uh when you're opening llamas or spending v bucks in battle royale or save the world and also uh, if you're purchasing a game from the epic store a lot of people using my creator code thank you very much you guys are amazing thank you i really 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 appreciate you for doing that thank you very much guys so let's start by opening this gift and then we're gonna go and we're gonna talk about some stuff okay so there's my winter llama all right so if you guys remember interesting uh if you guys remember the patch notes we did talk about the fact that they did say there was that big mix up with the llamas now it's been a while now so personally for me I didn't really expect anything. I didn't expect anything to, to, to be changed. I didn't expect anything in return, I guess. Um, but it was a mistake. And like I said before, if you were expecting or hoping for those Winter Llamas for a final chance to get those items that you still needed or you still wanted and logging in to find that uh, you had vacuum items in there, yeah that could have been pretty that that is pretty negative so we got one everyone got one and there should be Ooh, look at that day 462 i gave myself 100 v bucks thank you very much i will take those v bucks and if we go to my item shop i have four okay so i have four in here okay so upgrade llama that goes gold and silver die. we're not going to go for those um if i go here these okay these are not the, there's the winter llama but there should be in the future they said that it probably it probably will be in a gift box so probably as soon as we <coughs> i don't know i don't know how long it's gonna take but hopefully soon we're gonna log in and we're gonna get the equivalent of all the winter llamas that we did not open now that is pretty awesome i mean to me personally that is really awesome because not only am i getting these llamas but i'm gonna be getting I got all the all the ones from before in which I did get vacuum two weapons. Like I said, if you guys want to go check out that video, <laughs> it's got a little eye will pop up up there. You guys can go check it out. Um, I I got a lot of stuff, and I guess what I had theorized in that video is true that for some weird reason, the the you know the data got crossed, the lines got crossed, and we got the yet yeah, last year's llamas we got last year's winter llamas instead of this year's not sure how that happens but it happened so now we're gonna get twice as much so for those of us who opened several llamas at the end or left some tickets you know just to roll over ah, extra bonus all right so not gonna jump into a lot of the stuff that we have seen i will talk about one thing really quick which is the collection book now in a second we're gonna we're, you know we're gonna talk about two big things because I've got a list over there of several things to talk about. But you know what? If we go through all of them, it's going to be get too long. Uh, plus, there's a lot of little minor stuff. So we're gonna we're gonna focus on the top two, the top two, the big ones. I did see this one before, uh, and then someone did tell me about the other thing we're gonna talk about. Wow, which I haven't I haven't tested out yet. So we're gonna go test it out together. But this one actually was one of the things that I, after every single update, this is the first place I go to now, and it's the expansion place. I go to the expansion place to see what we have, and hmm. Hmm. 
For those of you who don't know what the expansion place is, the expansion place... Oh, yes. The expansion place is right here. Expansion schematic, expansion people. It's in your collection book. So all you got to do is go to armory, go to collection book, go all the way to the very bottom right behind me. You guys kind of can't see it there. But right there it says, right there it says expansion people, expansion schematics. This right here is something that, like I said before, why is this not in the patch notes, okay? I mean, this is huge, guys. This is awesome. This is incredible. And this gets, this gets, this gets really incredible, guys. Like, really incredible, okay? Because, yes, the, uh, the expansion people, in case you didn't know, uh, where are we? There, here, here. Um, the cyberpunk heroes are now obtainable through regular flux. So, this is kind of like, if you needed a Tet Shot Jess, if you needed a Tet Shot Jess, you can now recruit her without having to use one of your vouchers, okay? Harvester Sarah, Bulletstorm Jonesy, Heavy Base Kyle. Heavy Base Kyle. Yes. So, um, there we go. And more importantly, and this is the one <laughs> that I was really, really surprised about, <coughs> is the neon ranged and neon melee weapons they are now available now if you guys remember and this is kind of uh oh, i don't know how to say this I, I don't know how to feel about this but if, if you guys remember recently we had neon llamas and within the month actually we had neon llamas appear just out of nowhere and i will admit we've had them twice and i admit i fell for them the first time i spent 2500 v bucks on those neon llamas and got bleh. they came back another five of them at 500 each 200 2500 v bucks if you bought all 10 10 5000 5000 v bucks and here they are um I guess this kind of means that you know what we may see another llama we may see another llama show up very soon um I, I i don't really know which one it could be um i don't i don't know i don't know I, honestly i don't know guys i don't know which llama we're gonna see just pop up next but it's very possible that we are going to see another llama just show up very soon here in the in the, in the loot and, oh no, sorry. In the X-ray, we'll see right here in the X-ray. We'll see a llama pop up here. I don't know which one it could be. Personally, for me, I'm not gonna buy it. I'm not gonna buy it because if anything, this kind of shows that things are going to pop up in this in the expansion soon. Once they're in the expansion, you can you can recruit them. And and look at this neon sniper rifle. Mercury LMG and oh yes the big one the neon launcher so the noble launcher sorry the noble launcher um so there you go guys um all three of them all three of the event ones are obtainable right now and I will say this I don't know if this is a mistake I don't think it's a mistake guys but if I were you, definitely the Noble Launcher and the Neon Sniper Rifle. I mean, if you want the Mercury too. Um, these are totally worth it, guys. These are totally, totally worth researching. But this also means that they are now available. Yeah. Smile yeah. The phone. They should now also be available from the regular polls. So the poll pool is expanding so much more. Um, but there we go. Uh, I, I really don't know what else to say about that, guys. I think it's incredibly interesting. Um, let me go into, yeah, let me go into my Twine Peaks Arm Shield. I, I think it's really interesting, guys. I think it's, uh, I think it's, it's just, <sighs> I wish they would say something, okay? I mean, I'm, I'm gonna, I'm gonna say it straight out, guys. I wish they would just say something. It just feels like, you know, that is, that's a huge thing. 
that's a huge that's something that definitely merits a tweet merits um a, a part in the patch updates just saying look at this like wow we've expanded again the expansion uh the the schematic expansion or whatever you want to call it and you can now recruit or those heroes and you can research neon weapons including the big three including those three guys i don't know um i don't know if, it, if it's on purpose and if it's not then i would say make sure you recruit those as soon as you can or research them i, I don't know I, I don't think it is i think they're just going to be there forever I just don't understand why they don't let us know, including what we're going to talk about in a second right now. But before we jump into those, uh, let me go ahead and talk about this. So, uh, boop. Okay. So things that went live today, we had a tweet from Fortnite say a small twist to a familiar mission. Check out the newest Retrieve the Data beta storm in Save the World. Now, I haven't had a chance to, um, I haven't had a chance to, oh my gosh, man, that's crazy. Okay, wow. All right. I haven't had a chance to go through. I don't know if you guys saw that, but wow. I haven't had a chance to go through yet and um, and look at my um, at the missions yet. I'm probably going to go take a look at both beta storms, the racing one too. And we'll talk about that soon, the next couple of days. Um, and the other thing we had is they talked about this, the known issues blog. Let's talk about that in one second. Right now, let's talk about what just happened there. Now, I don't know if you guys saw this. I don't know if you guys just saw what I just did there. Oh, did my materials go up too? Oh no, yes. Okay, whoa. Okay. Um, so we're in we're in my where am I where in my base, right? We're in my base. Check it out. Um I am actually planning on destroying a lot of this stuff. Wait, how, how hurt are you? You're not even hurt, are you? <gasps> okay. So someone told me that they had fixed or they had given us one hit on SSD. SSD defenses. Am I getting the materials back? Oh my gosh, I'm getting the materials back. Okay. So... I am getting the materials back. Oops. Oh my goodness gracious. Okay. So, now, I, I don't know if you realize what just happened there, but it used to be that things in your SSD... Like, look at that. Look... Let's, 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 try, let's try a metal wall. Let's try three different metal walls of varying intensity or varying construction. Um, it used to be that, like everything else in the Save the World world, if you were to destroy a wall, it would take, you know, bang, 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 you'd have to destroy it. Now, now it seems that you get, not only can you one hit pretty much anything in your SSD, like we're in my SSD right now, just trying to sing up, Sorry. but you will get part of the materials back. Um, now I don't know, <coughs> I don't know how much I got back in those, uh -uh. but here we go. Oh, you know what? Let's try this. Let's see. Uh, so level ninety-one wooden floor spike. Let's see what we get back. Oops, I increased it. The all right. Well, oh, here we go. Wall dynamo. Does it tell me what I get back? I don't know what if I got anything else back. Wait, did I get the did I get the trap stuff back? I don't think so. I got the materials back, but okay. I didn't get the trap back. Did I get the materials back of the trap though? Maybe I don't know. I don't know. Well, here we go. Let's take a look at this though. Again, 1,600 health, one hit. 3,600 health, one hit. 5,600 health, one hit. Wow. Okay. So, um, rearranging, fixing, working on your SSDs just got a bi billion times easier. I'm happy. 
I actually get to go ahead and destroy everything here because I have something planned and I'm going to just go ahead and destroy everything. I get to destroy absolutely everything because I, I get to work on I get to work on this. I get to work on my on my base. Um yeah, my my base has some some stuff that I want to do uh, on it because I want to make it a little bit of a crazy base. But anyway, I'm going to leave it there, guys, for that. Wow. Okay. Wow. All right. Okay. Um, let me go ahead and just finish up by, by talking about this really, really quick. And like I said, we did get a tweet that said, Curious on the known issues we're currently investigating. Drop over to version 1.0. 8.10. Known issues blog. Yes. To find out, be sure to let us know <coughs> if you're experiencing any issue not listed in the link. And if you follow the link, you get to see this. 8.1 known issues by the Fortnite team. Hey folks, below you can find a list of the issues that we're actively investigating working on. Newly reported issues will be added to the list as well as we become aware of them. Battle Royale, Creative, Save the World, Impossibility Matrix Ability, is in function properly the root has been identified and working towards fix transferring items from storage to backpack is slower than normal the in-game soundtrack doesn't play during missions the root cost has been identified and working towards fix all game modes issues etc etc are you expecting an issue let us know on any of our social channels and please include information such as um so here if i if i if i were you um i wouldn't just tweet at them or whatever you know i, I don't know maybe I, I don't know how they want this um I would say to go ahead and create a, a bug report within the game. Also, you can, you know, file something in the trail report. Um, I guess, no, I don't know. If you want to, you can take a video or tweet them something or I, I, I don't know. I don't know what they're expecting here. Um, especially when you're, well, if you're on Reddit, I would recommend to go there, you know. Um... I'm not going to get too much into this because I'm still kind of confused at why they're doing it this way. Now, if you guys have been watching my videos for the last few days, you know, you know that this is kind of exactly what I've been asking for. But I kind of wish that they would. They said that they're going to be added, adding to this list. I want to keep an eye on this in the next few days and see if it does grow because if you guys all of us play save the world we know that there's quite a few other things that need to be added to that list and um yeah we'll have to see but uh, i like i said uh, when i saw this i was like oh interesting they're 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 doing it and then it's kind of like okay well you know not only are we lumped in with battle royale and save and creative i don't know if they have the same issue that we have in save the world are, are they also having that problem because anytime i ever see something on reddit or something or on twitter it's usually you know battle royale that they've identified a problem and they're working on it not necessarily for save the world so yeah i'm gonna leave it there i'm still confused let me know what you guys think. Thanks a lot for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Time to work on my SSD. See you guys.